Hello everybody, welcome to um, game number 22, I think, of the most fun against Roydku. A 510 TV difference, I don't know if he's got Journeyman, um, which has made this game, he does have Journeyman, so it's not actually over 500 TV difference. Um, went guard on this guy, 3 guard, claw palm, 14 players, what does he have? He has currently, oh, of course, 11 players. He's got a claw palm with Dauntless. Thankfully, his claw palm horns guy is out. He's got three guard. A rookie, but no, a sure hands ball. And uh, movement seven block break tackle one. Interesting to see what he'll do with his 430 then, because he doesn't, of course, have access to Hathark the Unstoppable, great star player. Thanks, Cyanide, he only has a crappy Mino, but even then the crappy Mino could do something. But if he gets the Mino, he's got to spend his own money for a wizard. Or or he might just go Apo or Babes or something, Bribe, who knows. Yeah, not down in TV, unbelievably. Yeah, there are there are games at the moment with over five hundred TV difference. That I know I know that is true, um, but yeah, better coaches ostensibly they're better coaches in Champion Ladder because when you've got the choice between the two, why would you go for open if you're competitive basically? So so the the more competitive coaches tend to go for Champion Ladder. I mean, the only thing is keeping your team, you know. So, so like, you've got the likes of Mull who do play in open a bit to keep his team that's got a history and stuff. And maybe Ducky would play in, in open to use his champion teams. But, um... Okay, he's not got anything. I don't know if he's going to AFK the whole match or if he's just going to concede. But, um... Yeah, it helps. I mean, look, TV isn't the be-all and end-all, but it helps. And plus, there's different TV, isn't there? You know, like, my my 1860 Nurgle team here is going to be better than, you know, most 1500 TV teams. But then this, I could have a so much better team for 1860 TV, you know, like. So, it just depends. It depends on how... It depends on how they're built, aren't they? Not all, not all, eighteen hundred TV teams are equal, and what have you. Even from the same race, like this could be so much better. This eighteen sixty TV team it could be so much better than what it is. Right. So the twenty four star player point one, and the sixteen star player point are the ones that are blitzable, or could actually make him blitzable and him blitzable. That might be better, seeing he's got the claw palm. He is his bull could run around to blitz, so maybe maybe protect these guys. But on the other hand, if they go here and he follows up to pile on, they get to hit them back, don't they? Might go for him so he can't both down. Because he's more likely to go for this guy because he can both down him, can't he? To get that removal. So that's good to have the Wrestle Fender that side as well. That seems okay. Yeah, but 1800 TV Nurgle could be that good. That's the thing, isn't it, Random Ad? It's easy to say, oh shit, I didn't see his record, no. Um, Eon is his name. Is, is it... Is more is more dot com working now? Let's have a look. He's won fourteen, drawn four, lost five, so he's not bad. He's conceded four times with his team. <laughs> four of his five losses are concessions. He's conceded five times in total already, so he might not want to concede again. But he's got a pretty good record, to be fair. 4-1-1 with Undead. B 
But that's the thing, you, you know, just saying 800 TV Nurgle, like, look up for the same TV, this team loses five skills on shitheads and then gains two claw pom. <laughs> Which is just, is just insane, isn't it? Like, how much better is this team if it's got three claw pommers and loses skills on shitheads? It becomes twice as good. So, yeah, TV is not the be-all and end-all, but... Unless you unless you build your team absolutely terrible, um, then more TV is better. He got zero inducements, Fashbinder. He let the um, he let the clock run down. So maybe maybe a concession will be incoming here. But I mean, he could get lucky, couldn't he? Really lucky. <laughs> <laughs> You could get really lucky. There you go. First block, Kaz. Standard kills. So that, that's that guy sacked. So I'm glad I didn't sack the block claw guy because someone else has been sacked instantly. Which is fine. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry, Infra Augustus. The hero of the team has died. <laughs> that was a block, wasn't it? And he had to follow up to put, be able to pile on. Ross could do, but he can he can maybe cover him, can't he? Okay, not really cover him. No, I guess he can't cover him. Yeah, he should have blitzed, shouldn't he? He's got two guards next to him. I've got a GFI to hit him, but obviously I will. Oh, while following this dirty player and turn one, one idiot. And when I say what an idiot, I'm not really insulting this person. I'm not saying he's an idiot, but I think this is a bad, a bad move to um, maybe get his dirty player sent off on following anybody other than my claw palm guy. I could obviously. The temptation is to blitz this guy, isn't it? But um, I'm not gonna. GFI. Greed it. Nothing. Absolutely fucking standard. Thank you for the follow, Simon Spank. That was the only possible path to get two dice, Ducky. He was flanked by guard, so the only possible way to get two dice on him was to put the guard in here and GFI. Maybe I should have blitzed him, because then the the both down would have been the knockdown, would have, would have been able to maybe scaz him. You know, maybe I should have just blitzed here, rather than burning a reroll, taking my killer out of position completely. Fen doing something actually decent. Yeah, it's hard with the um, 
with so many skills, isn't it? Now his claw now his claw bomber gets to hit my claw bomber potentially. <laughs> this is fun, isn't it, eh? This is fun. First move Lona blocks fine. I mean he's he's getting he's getting what he needs to happen, isn't he? Two armor breaks. Cause this he knows he knows that this is what the game rests on. And I mean, I encourage that, I guess, by making the blitz. Maybe I shouldn't have made that blitz. Four dice on his killer. My guy gets KO'd. Seems, seems fair, doesn't it? Seems fair. <laughs> I don't think he's done anything wrong at all, honestly. I think that was the right move to make there. Wow. <laughs> Three men down. Three men down, turn two. Who said that I shouldn't have had so many reserves? What was Ducky saying about if you base with some guard that that can work out okay? I mean, I wasn't obviously I wasn't did didn't do that on purpose. I should have fucking piled on and killed him, but you know, that's what happened, isn't it? I left I gave him extra blocks and and then these two both got KO'd. Like this one was kind of essential to get the 2D from him and obviously he didn't mean to be blocked. But he makes blocks, he KOs people and stuns people. It's it's obvious, isn't it? That you want to if you want your team to survive, you give away as little blocks as possible. It's obviously the best way to stay alive. I'm roughly 2 to 1 in cause suffered as well, to be honest. But the good thing is, he still can't win this, probably. Probably he still can't win. Two chances to get the killer back. And a 1 1 draw, I'm happy with. So, Just thank God he didn't take any inducements here. This would have been hard against a wizard and a load of bribes or whatever. Well, okay, saying he can't win. Oh, God, heat. Oh, my God. All right, well, the heat should fuck him more than it fucks me. Yeah, he could fuck me. He could really fuck me. Good job, I've got three reserves. But, um... He can't win this half, is kind of what I meant. <laughs> um, Like, you know, if he scores... If he beats the living piss out of me like he's done... Um... He still just scores on turn eight. I get two. Chan I get the double LOS hits. Um, but yeah, sweltering heat is a way I can lose definitely. Mass removals and sweltering heat ways I can lose this game. They've both happened so far. Psh, 
I'm not gonna take injuries instead. To be honest, Morgan the Mad. Plus, it's it doesn't matter because they're gonna be. The touchdown's gonna happen, isn't it? And reset them. Only three players down, but locked out, aren't I? I'm just locked out. That's the um. That's the issue. He can blitz him. He can block, he can block. But then it's this fuckhead, I want to get away from him, don't I? He could one dice him, but... The big dog, the push. <laughs> Watch out. One, two, three, four. And it, though these dead guys, one, two, three, four. GFI is going to club on mastering four next turn. Unless I stand him up, but then he'll just hit him with him. I'm fine drawing this game, so it's alright. Can't even pile on him. Doesn't need to, kills him anyway. Oh, it doesn't die! Oh man! What a, what a superstar. Doesn't even die. Claw's literally, Claw Palm's literally the worst player he could possibly choose to Claw Palm. Makes a Kaz. After my Claw, my claw Palm, I fail four dice on him. Joke. Joke or what? I'd rather be playing Sims 4 right now. Who goes? You decide. He really doesn't need inducements, does he? Calcium, you correct? Mugged right off. He fucking hasn't needed it. Imagine if he'd got a wizard and two bribes as well. I'd be absolutely fucked right now. Oh, he nearly misclicked but didn't. What a cunt.
I'm already not standing these guys up because they'll just get knocked down. When these six get knocked down, they're not standing up again. This is me off. I mean, that's, that's the thing, isn't it? It's just dice, isn't it? But, you know, I literally give him the worst possible player he can possibly blitz with Claw Palm. He casts him without using a reroll. And after he gave up his guy to be Claw Palm by my Claw Palmer. And it wouldn't, wouldn't have exposed my Claw Palmer to a foul either. Unlike Fash's, where Fash went for his, his uh, four dice blitz on Lupax Killer. With the payoff being he was gang fouled, guaranteed. I did it with no chance of a gang foul. Nothing. <laughs> yeah, the canoring threat. I can't even dirty play a foul him. Well, I lose I can. If I have to stand him up. Blitz out, blitz him. Could even go for the win if I um, double GFI. Could dodge out, blitz him. Still just a no assist foul. I will get sent off. Good rotter. No assist foul or not. Nah, fuck it. Would have been nice to have gone round here, wouldn't it? How could I have surfed the chalf on a dodge? Oh, you mean if I'd got a push? <laughs> He hasn't killed anybody, he's just um he's just cast a couple of rock oh no he killed he killed um Cardell the disoriented. He's got minus movement or agility or something. Um so he's only killed one guy. And these two could come back. You never know. Stranger things have happened than making KO rolls.
Yeah, not on the one in nine, yeah, of course not. Ah, he's agreed this he's got to. Look at that, not even, not even, is he going to score then? I just run away with a beast, with a guy. Has he found a way to lose this game? That'd be good, wouldn't it? Come on, double one in. Of course not. Just make GFIs because you can, eh? That's a good idea. How how bad do you have to play when your opponent isn't even trying to stop you scoring and they get a chance to stop you scoring? Unbelievable. Not punished though, not punished for giving us that 2D on the ball there. down no of course not just meant that my guy got hit by mighty blow for no reason it's all I achieved with that Six plus dodge into minus two D. No. Crazy. 
bust it out. <laughs> he gets a bull guaranteed for the second half. And all my guys are able to roll for it. <laughs> oh, man. This is a dicing and a half so far, isn't it? Outrageous. I mean, sure, my team isn't that killy. It's not like I've got loads of claw pommer or anything. I've got one claw pommer, one mighty blow. It's like the least killing Nurgle team of all time. But still, 400 more TV. You'd have thought something would have happened, wouldn't you? Rather than me just getting out bashed to fuck. <laughs> fuck spunk awful day. <laughs> Fair chance to your daughter. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> hopefully it comes here. It is crazy. <laughs> Let's not start the Monopoly discussion again. <laughs> right. Claw claw blitz on a on a guy. And that guy seems good. And in case there's a riot, no, I'm not at home. So there could be a riot. What happens with a riot? He goes here, I guess. <laughs> he didn't want me to score a one turner yet. Yeah. <laughs> Says the guy getting hit by Mighty Blow. Seems seems fair. So if I power push him to here to get an extra block on him. And Oh, he's got guard, really? Oh, that's fucked up. Isn't it? Didn't see that behind all the other fucking skills. So now he can come back, he can come round here. To get the, um,. Mighty ball if it's a push. <sighs> Roll to pow. Feels amazing, man. Kaz. So he at least doesn't get an apple for the second half. That's something. But two of his guys don't need to roll. Well, two of mine don't potentially if they come back. It's just it's all about the sweltering heat now, isn't it? Heat and KO rolls. It was actually worse that I made that Kaz there, wasn't it? Because it saved him a saved him a. Heat roll. One's back. Alright, so no killer for the rest of the match. That seems fair. Killer filled both KO rolls. He filled none. He filled no heat rolls. 
And I failed three. Yeah, brilliant. brilliant. Outstanding. Outstanding. I love Blood Bowl so much. So very, very much. It's hard to put into words how much I love Blood Bowl. He filled one out of 20. And you I shouldn't have, I should have sacked that guy, shouldn't I? 14 players was too many. Um, whoever, whoever said 14 players was too much. Not at home, Tony. And um, even if I was at home, of course, I had the um, the other one. Mm, what do I do? Do I protect this beast man? I guess so. Get a get his guy a bit further back as well. Yeah, I could have got an extra 2D on a hob. Oh god, that pushes him there, that, so that's pretty awful. Still okay though, isn't it? Unless he runs all the way around. I don't know if he can or not. Didn't even count the squares. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. GFI, 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 he can. So I'll have to go back here. Yeah, well done, well done, Fash. Well done, well called, Fash. He gets all 11. He started with 11, and he's kept 11 for the entire match. He's never been down a play, has he? Oh, no, there was the Kaz on the last turn, which failed him. Which I, There was one heat, which was a good, good for him, because it meant he didn't have to roll. And then there was the Kaz, which was good for him, which meant he didn't have to roll. So the only time he's been down men were on turn A to avoid heat. Never had 11 players. Well, did I have 11 players for any turns? No, I never had a turn with 11 players on the pitch. Just, just standard. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the, the zero inducements, I thought it was either going to run down the clock every turn to troll, or um, just use a loner there, by the way, just loner re-roll it, why not? But this is certainly how I can lose games, eh? <laughs> this is what it takes me to lose a game in Blood Bowl 2. Just think, if I'd made the blitz on him instead, my my killer wouldn't have been cast. We'll hold him. Just scoring at all is going to be a fucking struggle, bleeding hippie. I mean, of course, I'd, I'd like to score. I just scoring at all is is the is the fucking issue. But yeah, I'm not going to try and stall it out. Misplay there, I think. 
Huge misplay. Oh, he's just given up the middle, hasn't he? Outrageous, outrageously poor play. So, that's good. <laughs> of course, I couldn't get a knockdown. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> that couldn't fucking happen, could it? Two GFIs and go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So oh, good. Don't get to fucking hit anybody though, did I? Because I didn't wanna didn't oh, I get to hit him, alright, good. Follow here. Yeah. Yeah, he overcommitted. He overcommitted massively. How 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 can someone play that bad? It's unbelievable, isn't it? Six men on the pitch, and he lets me do this. All he had to do was just keep both balls back. If he keeps both balls back, I'm done. Or, or a bull and a hob. But especially two balls. But yeah, a bull and a hob, and I'm just done. Get another cars, why not? I guess I should have dodged, dodged that, because he was always going to blitz with his bull. He can't, no, he can't. Re can he reach with the bull? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, G5, G5. If you can't reach for the ball. Looks like he can though. Oh yeah, he can go this way. So I had I had to leave him there in case he didn't cast him, I think. Maybe I should have done, I don't know. Oh yeah, just just not only with heat, just because even even without heat, I would how 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 do I stall it at all? So yeah, I guess I should have dodged away there, but on the other hand, I thought, if it takes people up, it's good, isn't it? Anything that occupies his players is good. Because he could have just rolled pushes, and then... And I guess he's 75% and knocked me down, but there was a chance. Alright, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, J5, J5, so he gets him anyway. He just, he just made all the dice, all the pals. The GFI, the loan of GFI, he just rolled all of the dice that he needed. And now he'll get the power on the two dice here. Made everything. Oh, there you go. Didn't make everything. Oh, he's still got the reroll. Shit. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. Wow, not a push. Unbelievable, Jeff. Fail the show hands pick up into being served. Oh, God. <laughs> Takes the fucking piss, doesn't it? What an absolute piss take of a game.
<laughs> yeah, that's true, Tony Pooh. No, it was he can't win that half, though. He couldn't win that half, right? It was true. It was true, and he didn't win that half. Um, you know, he didn't win. He didn't win that half, did he? He won with the with this with this heat is is, and then these failed rolls is how he won. He couldn't win in that half, though, could he? He's not even an idiot. Like he's, he played. He played pretty decently the first half. I thought he made. He made the right moves the first half. But yeah, I guess he overcommitted hard there, and he's made some mistakes, hasn't he? he? Doesn't make him an idiot. And even then, being bad at blood ball doesn't make you an idiot, does it? Either so. But wow, amazing that he gave us the chances he gave us. No, oh, don't say that, cornflakes and milk. Don't say that. <laughs> Just a dummy, not an idiot. No, I mean, my, as, as I've said before on this stream, I've got a friend who is is very clever, but he's bad at Blood Bowl, it doesn't... Doesn't mean anything, does it? And I don't even want to roll it out. And I can't even I can't even be mean to him in chat because he was four hundred T V down. I guess he was a dummy to not take any inducements. I mean, sure, I should have murdered him, and it was a completely insane result, but then he shouldn't have been matched up 420 TV down, should he? So, I can't even begrudge him the win, because the matchmaking fucked him, you know, as ridiculously hard as the dice fucked me, so... Yeah, but he's never been down eleven men apart from when it was advantageous to be to be down men. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> I think your friend who's good at blood ball. Um let's have a look. What's he 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 chooses not to care for the Sims. To make it funny, and I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure that's what he does. He's pretty decent at driving trucks, actually. He he learnt though from Fashbinder that once you have loads of money, you don't give a fuck about driving your trucks. Doesn't PVP in GTM? Well, it does do races though, but you know, never mind. Um, not Legend Hearthstone. Fair one. Hasn't really tried. He is a top fellow. I agree. Yeah, you learn how to sprint in Super Meat Boy. Yeah, no one should call anyone an idiot for fucking not making optimal plays in Blood Bowl, should they? I mean.
<laughs> Ce Yeah, he's playing Farling for the loss he should have had, yeah. I think he's pretty good at stacking the men on top of each other and not your friend. It's better to fight a walk out with a slinger and open terrain fast because then they don't have defensive terrain bonuses. So, so there you go. And now he's running out the turn. Wow, now you can insult him. Now you can insult him. Now that he's running down the clock. With nobody standing up. And he's running down the clock. Now you can call him a scumbag. Now you can call him an absolute cunt for running the clock down. And I'm going to run adverts. Because I, I can. I want to see how much money they come in. No, I'm not going to. Because it's a bit cuntish, isn't it? I'll just do it and have a piss. Wow, what a fucking cunt. What a complete con. Running the clock down there. Three minutes twenty for that turn there. No, sorry, two minutes twenty for that turn. What an absolute piece of shit. What a piece of human garbage. <laughs> yeah, that's that is a work of art. Oh, that's not as good as the one with all the Shawnee heads. The Shawnee heads one is better. All the Shawnees in the audience. Really bad luck, the rib cracker. Really bad luck. What, twice? In consecutive turns have done the colours. Maybe he's... Maybe he's fake news. That's amazing, Skurumet, so... Maybe he's just too busy laughing at how much he's how much he's absolutely diced the ever living fuck out of me. That is unbelievable. That is a dicing and a half, isn't it? And that's why I had fourteen players and it didn't even do me any good. All those games were just being bloat. And then the game that I get banged on having all those reserves didn't even help. Still start the second half with like six players or something. Outrageous. I don't want to rematch against somebody this fucking lucky. <laughs> wow. Wow. Lost a fan factor, that's good. Six AV breaks. 13 AV breaks into three cast and four KOs. That doesn't even look that lucky, does it? 29, 29 blocks sustained. Into 13 armor breaks. And even then, some of the armor breaks were at the end when he was just fouling for fun. Sixteen eighty. Armor, armor means he's definitely sacked. I'll do it now in case I kill loads of players next game. Nine, ten, eleven. So I guess I've got to buy a reserve, and it's whether to go with a pestigo or a rotter. And I'm, I don't know. I just. I'm inclined to go rotter, but maybe it's time to get the pest. Get a bit more movement. Could be the better shout, couldn't it? 
No. Right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, maybe that's it. Not taking the inducements was what won him the match. So there you go. That was the that was the second loss. Um and I think that's yeah, the unskilled pesty is horrible blow, that's the thing. Um, but then, of course, you, you don't get a skilled pesty without having a skill. You don't have a skilled pest to go without having an unskilled pest to go. Um, right. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.